It's lucky for me that you're here, Outlander. The name's Jax. A squad of Tanakh is holed up in that cave. I think they're in trouble. At least one of them is injured. I'm here to offer help, but with the Tanakh, such an offer might be perceived as an insult, even when help is needed. Will you stand with me? I saw you speak before the chorus, so I know you can be persuasive. And if things get out of hand, I will be stronger with your spear at my side. I'll do what I can. You there! This camp belongs to Eagle Squad. Retreat or die. At ease, Eagle. I'm not here for blood. Just to parlay. You know the parlay sign? Let us in so we can talk. So far, so good. Long way from the desert, aren't we? This one was blinded. Boy, nothing gets by you. Looks like your training mission didn't go according to plan. We're here to help, if you want it. How does an Utaro know we're on a training mission? He knew how to request a parlay, too. He's not Utaru. Or Tenax. He must be a veteran. A veteran? I didn't think there were any left. We don't need help from a washed-out farmer. Could have fooled me, judging by the look of things. Sister, it sounds like they just want to help us. Why not let them? What have we got to lose? You said you're on a training mission? A machine hunt. The final test before a young squad goes on active duty. Everything was going fine. We tracked a claw strider and hit it hard, but it fled into a herd of bristlebacks. One charge right at Kore. He dodged just in time and landed a strike as it passed. I hit an acid canister. The spray was like fire in my eyes. A terrible wound. I should have scouted ahead, spotted the herd. No, I should have spotted that canister. What does it mean to be a veteran? I was born to not, but offered to Utaro in exchange for tribute. Tribute? Back when there was plenty, the Utaru offered yearly gifts of food to the Tanakh to keep peace between them. Over time, this tribute grew into an exchange of people. The Tanakh needed able-bodied youth to fight their clan battles, and the Utaru needed veteran soldiers to train the defenders of Plainsong. I was just such a soldier. Was being the key word. You may yet need my spear, young warrior. What do you need? Supplies. Dried meat, ammunition, weapons, camping equipment. A lot of provisions for a trip back to the desert. Everything we need is at River Watch. A huge cache of war spoils up there, left over from the route. The route? When our forces drove the Karja back to Baron Light, they made sure the Kestrels felt the loss, made it hurt. Marshal Canera shot a score of fleeing Karja from the top of River Watch, and her squad gathered the loot. It's all just sitting up there. Ours for the taking. Deadly machines are known to patrol that place, and the ruin itself is on the brink of collapse. You think machines and rotting ruins are enough to keep out Eagle Squad? No, but your injuries are. Let Jax and I grab these supplies for you. This is our mission. I'm not handing it over to some... Fine. Come with us. Fine. The three of you hold position. I'll be back. Be safe, sister. The ruin is this way. Once we get those supplies, everything will be fine. So you say. What's that supposed to mean? Your brother's condition is... That's not your problem, farmer. So you say. 
saying that. Hey, calm down. We're trying to help, remember? So you say. We'll have to cut across the river. Avoid the Outlander camp down the road. Trespass. Ugh! Something wrong? I hate getting wet. Tough as a ravager, this one. I heard that. We're here. The entrance should be right under that arch. There she is. Told you she'd be back. I'm going in. No. Aloy's on point. Follow her lead. That's the last of them. You know, if this... I guess the farmer hasn't lost all his fighting spirit. Supply should be up there. Taller than I thought. What's a deadly climb to Eagle Squad? What are you trying to say, old man? Enough. I've climbed this tower before. I'll grab the supplies. Come. Let's see if any of these machines have parts we can strip. Maybe I'll show you a thing or two. What could a farmer possibly know about salvage? Only decades of experience compared to your very brief existence. Okay, gotta find a way into the ruins. Some kind of... Gotta find a way up. Okay, the supply cache should be at the top of the tower. But how to get up there?
before. Must have missed the supplies. of the supplies won't last them very long. I can't leave that kid alone for a second. Jax and Sakura are in trouble. I gotta catch up. and take down those machines. Didn't want to leave all the fun to us. It's done. I better check on Jax and Sakura. Well fought, Eagle. Though I would have preferred if you hadn't taunted that thing. What did you find? Practically nothing. Sakura, there's maybe a day's worth of food here and some rotting medicinal herbs. There was supposed to be more. Enough for... It was never your intention to go home, was it? What do you mean? A blind Tanakh can't fight. And if you can't fight... The Tanakh will kill Korra from being blind? He'll face a trial against the machine. They say it's more dignified that way. But it's still a death sentence. So you were gonna use the extra supplies to live in the wilds? I thought it would be enough to get us started. Can't they stay in Plainsong? For Tanakh? The Chorus would never allow it. We should get back. I'll take this young sprout back. Meet us at the cave when you can.
Truth, plain and simple. Aloy, we were just about to head in. So what will you tell them? That we'll have to make do. Survive in the wilds without the supply. Be a hard life. Better than letting Cory be killed if we go back. There must be another way. I don't see one. So, we're all stocked up then? The cache was empty. But we'll be alright without them. I can't let you starve out here. Just leave me. No! Jax, you said Plainsong has too many mouths to feed to take them all in, but... What about just... I am not leaving my brother behind! He'll be safe in Plainsong. And the rest of you can head home. It's the only real solution you've got. The Cores won't like it. But if I vouch for the boy, I could convince them. I will do so if Cora wishes. No! You're not taking him! Sakura, I think this is the best option. I'm a burden to you out here. This is what I want. Let me go with him. Permission granted. But brother, this is not the end for us. I will visit you in Plainsong, and no Utaru or Tanakh can stop me. They will be foolish to try. I'll stay and help them pack their gear, then take Korra back with me. You've shown strength and wisdom today. Rare company. You have my thanks, and theirs too, I'm sure. Something interesting happened.
First the frost breath, then the snow. Judging by these markers, that climbing trail Jekka talked about must be nearby. I should check up on her brother while I'm here. Looks like they're in charge. I should talk to them. Wallbreaker, if you've come to witness the March of the Ten, you're out of luck. Actually, I came looking for someone called Pento. Pento? That poor scab was as good as dead even before the storm hit. You're out of line, soldier. What's he talking about? The kid you're looking for is still up on the mountain, along with two others. Pento was the only one who decided to break tradition and climb without a partner. His odds aren't... I'm sorry to say they never were to begin with. As far as being Tanak goes, he's got most of it backwards. So what? You're all just waiting here? Shouldn't you be calling for help? Couldn't find anyone in that storm, even if we wanted to. Those kids are at the mercy of the mountain now. We'll see about that. But first, a couple of questions. Why is everyone so sure this Pentaw can't climb that mountain? Our people are soldiers. We respect strength and agility. Pento has neither. Never has. He's been stuck on cleaning duty since he was a child. Yet he decided to undergo our clan's most difficult trial on his own. And you think he's crazy for trying? I'm not a fan of that word. When I chose to wear a woman's armor, people called me crazy too. I guess Pento just feels like he has to prove himself. To show who he really is. I understand. Believe me. But that climb is hard enough, even without a storm. What is this march you mentioned? This is one of the toughest slopes in Sky Clan territory. It's said that the Ten climbed this mountain in pairs during their war against machines. Our people partner up to earn their soldiers' marks by following in the Old One's footsteps and retrieving the Blood Crest, a flower that grows on the summit. Until Pento, that is. You, know. you mean no one wanted to climb up with him? I tried to stop him, but there were technically no rules against it, so I let him pass. That sounds familiar. The Nora have a similar ritual. No one wanted me in that one either. Their mistake, I presume. Yep. I could try following the path up the mountain. See if I can find Pentaw. You said there were two other climbers missing as well? Just one. The other is right there. Zika! Rocco and I, we were climbing back down. There was an avalanche where we got separated. I couldn't see anything. Someone's gotta go up there. You can barely see your own feet in that storm. Except I don't need to. I'll be back. Are you wounded? Just if the storm gets too rough, I can always use my focus to find those climbers. I should follow the markers. They'll lead me to the start.
Markers. I'm on the right track. Sounds like someone's putting up a fight. That's not good help. Whoever you are, thanks for the assist. You okay? Not really, but I'll live. Your climbing partner, she said you got separated during an avalanche? My partner? Yeah, the avalanche caught us off guard. Swept me up like a twig. I was sure I was a goner. Then someone grabbed hold of me and pulled me out. It was pain. He risked his life for me. Did you see where he went? Up that cliff behind you. Said he was gonna finish the climb. I told him it was suicide. But he wouldn't listen. Can you make it back down on your own? Yes. You're not going after him, are you? Go. Get back to Wakata before the storm gets any worse. May the Ten be with you. I have to find Penta before he gets himself killed. Pack's full, but my stash has room. my focus to pick up Pinto's trail. Those must be Pinto's tracks. Oh, let's hope I can catch up to him. It looks like the avalanche destroyed most of the climbing path. The missing soldier must have climbed up this way. Pinto made it past here. The path must have collapsed after him. Maybe I can glide across. I need to get past this trench. Sliding over to the other side of that trench. <laughs> Let's hope that's Pento.
Penta? Do I know you? Wakata sent me. We need to get off this mountain, now. No. I'm not going back there as a failure. I am getting that flower no matter what. Look, I know what it's like when you- Then you understand why I'm either gonna get to the top of this mountain or die on it. Thank you. What are you doing? This climb is meant to be done by two people, right? I'll be your partner. I'll follow your lead. Here, should be useful. Looks like the trail carries on here. Save these for when I need it. Here, I got some spare ammo. You know my name, but I don't think I caught yours. It's Aloy. You sure you want to involve yourself with the Bulwark's biggest loser, Aloy? I like to make my own judgments about people. You know, it's not like everyone can be born with a... What was that? I don't know. Maybe it's just the wind. I hope so. Found something? That was amazing! Free down! It should let us reach the climbing path! You won't hear me complaining. You're back. We still have to climb our way up the mountain. Don't know where that leads, but I'll wait till you're done. for you. I was hoping you'd be back to finish the march. Alright, off the mountain I go. Pento deserves to do the climb with a partner. I should head back to him.
We should be able to jump onto that climbing path from the tree. That's some climbing gear you've got. Thanks. It's time to start climbing. That doesn't sound like any storm wind I've ever heard. Almost there. This is it. I can't believe we actually made it. Let's get to that side. Frost Claw! Oh, just what we need. We can handle it. Come on. I take this with me? Storm. It's easing up. So, how does it feel to make rank? Pretty great, actually. This... This means everything to me. You know, even if you go back with that, it doesn't mean they'll treat you any different. Honestly, I think... I just need to prove to myself I could do this. You should go back. Let the others know I'm okay. I'd like to take a moment, if you don't mind. I'll be right behind you. Of course. Thank you. I can probably reach the bottom of Should be reaching the bottom of the trail soon. Pedro can't be far behind. There's everyone. Aloy, do you have any news? Please. I need to know what happened to my brother. Lying like that, Jekka. You're the sister of a proper soldier now. Pedro! Ow! 
I bring you the blood crest as proof of my march. And with my blessing, you join our ranks. May you find your path on the wings of the ten. You've got to be kidding me. Him? A soldier? Please. Flower or no flower, we all know all he'll ever be good for is cleaning everyone's sh- I think we're done here. Better put some snow on that, or it'll bruise. Thanks for saving my life. Maybe when I get my own soldier's mark, we can fight in the same squad. Give me a chance to return the favor. He's cute. Go on. I'll catch up. Here. Something to commemorate our climb. May the Ten always grant you victory, Aloy. I'll see you around, Pentoff. <laughs> 